Hello, and I'd like to welcome you all once again to the old schoolhouse here in the village of Butterstone in Perthshire in Scotland for another one of our wee live concerts. This is the 10th <laughs> live concert. And uh, so this is a wee bit of an anniversary show uh, tonight, and uh, I can't believe we've done 10 already. And um, for those of you who are just joining us, we're in the actual old village school in Butterstone. Butterstone has got 10 houses, and it's where I grew up. And this is the wee village hall where uh, all the rural kids were uh, taught in. And uh, I went to school here, and my father went to school here in the 1930s. And uh, then uh, about 30 years ago, I was able to buy it and it's turned it into my recording studio and uh, made most of my records here. So it's great to be able to do these live shows from, uh, from the old schoolhouse. And um, uh, like I say, I'm working my way through my songs. I'm trying not to repeat any, and the, the further in I get, the more difficult it is because of the songs that I haven't, I don't keep up to uh, my head, uh, keep in my head all the time. So, uh, and because it's my tenth, because it's the tenth anniversary, I've got my wee twelve-year-old malt whiskey sitting there just to have a wee toast with you at the end. So anyway, this is a song, uh, it's nice to write love songs, but there are hundreds of love songs around, you know, and I, so I've always tried to find a, a different way to write a love song, and uh, this is one of them, and uh, we'll try it now and see how we get on. Halfway there and halfway gone, but we bend and believe the strength of the light, the signs we receive, and we are not careful, clear, we struggle on from year to year, and on the waves of our fate, we drift like the boat. Anchored too late. Oh, but I'm not alone in the force of this wildest unknown. She is the deepest part of me. She is the deepest part of me. We do not have the truth to tell but some have flown while others fell what seemed to be right now darkens our way clouds in our sight and we do not have the eyes to see the magic and the that it fills that allows us to sleep so silent and still Oh but I'm not alone in the force of this wildest unknown She is the deepest part of me She is the deepest part of me And when Resolution seems so far away. Time always turns into the light of day. Oh, see me when I lose. Signs we receive. Oh, 
but I'm not alone in the force of this wildest unknown. She is the deepest part of me. She is the deepest part of me. She is the deepest part of me. She is the deepest part. Thank you very much. Um, I'm assuming that you're clapping at home in front of your uh, big TV screens or your laptops or your iPhones or whatever you're uh, watching on. Um, I, uh, that's my wee song called She Is The Deepest Part Of Me. And uh, I'm going to do this song now, which... Um, give me a wee... I've got to change guitars here. Um, yeah, this, this song came after learning about the, the discovery of the Lewis chessmen. And uh, I have a little house up on the west coast of Lewis in a beautiful little place. And um, they were discovered, the Lewis chessmen, and you've probably seen them. They're the amazing little chess pieces. And um, they, they, they believe they were made in the 11th century or something. They were found in the, th the, I, think the, the I can't remember when they were found. The, but they believe that they're 11th century chess pieces. And they were found on the beach just along the road from the, where my wee house is. And so I was imagining, I actually have three of the little guys here, uh, which I thought I would try and show you. And uh, they're the most miserable looking characters you've ever seen. And the Queen's got her head in her hand like that. She's looking really pissed off. And, and uh, the wee guys... And uh, maybe we can actually try something with uh, Jenny. We haven't done this before, but we can try and manually. We're using an automated camera system that my son set up for me. But we can't override it. I'm going to just see if we can override the camera and, 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 and have a wee look at my chess piece uh, there. There's the, there's, the wee, there's the wee queen with her head. There's the wee guy on his horse. And there's the kind of grumpy looking king. <laughs> and uh, they're amazing, m most miserable little people. Pe Pieces and I had this, I had this kind of imagining, uh, and I was on, the, I was walking on the beach where, I was walking on the beach where they were found, and I was imagining these little guys all kind of lined up, coming up the beach um, in in Uig and, and kind of heading for shore and wondering what they were, what their adventure they were on and what they were up to, what mischief they were up to, and I had this idea of holding them in in my hand and them kind of being real, kind of aggressive <laughs> and. and uh, uh, this is one of them funny things, and I hadn't even drunk any whiskey or anything like that at all. It was just the, the, the moment. So I wrote this strange song. It's called Match and Mystery, and uh, and we'll see how we got on with this. Uh, and I want you all to try and imagine these little guys coming up the beach.
Thank you very much. Um, that's my song about the very strange little Lewis chess men. And um, <laughs> I remember we were up there with some friends, you know, and uh, we were walking along the beach and there were some bones of an old sheep that had been buried on the sand dunes sticking out of the, out of the, 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 uh, the sand dune. And uh, my, good, was my good friend David Duncan was with us and he says, he says, oh, look, he says, the Lewis chess player. <laughs> We'd found the Lewis chess player. But anyway, it was kind of funny. And um, so I'm going to do this wee song. This is a part of the show where I do a wee chorus. And uh, it's been a very strange day. A very strange thing happened today. This is uh, my friend uh, Tatty Face. And those of you who have been watching the shows will know all about Tatty Face. But for those of you who don't, because I have a, an automated uh, camera system here, um, I have to kind of focus the cameras myself, and uh, there's just me and Jenny in, in, in the school here. And um, so I use Mr. Mr. Uh, Tatty Face. He gets used for, for setting up the camera shots and the, and the focus and everything. And then he plays a wee bit on the stage with me, and he's become quite a character. And he's actually quite a good guitar player. And um, But he... Um, but he, a um, strange thing happened today. His brother showed up in my garden. He's called Duncan, I believe it. You know. He says he's been hiding in my shed for the last four weeks. And <laughs> he, uh, he describes himself as a professional tatty bogle. And a tatty bogle is a Scottish word for a scarecrow. And uh, so he's actually being employed, as, as we speak, out in the garden uh, for his board and lodgings. And uh, I don't know whether he had anything to do with him or I, you know, <laughs> keeping him hidden in the shed. But anyway, he also says he's a wee bit of a guitar player. So I'm really not sure about that, whether we'll let him up on the stage or not. But I'll send you a photograph of him tomorrow. Uh, just, you'll be able to... Uh, <laughs> and I've just picked up the wrong guitar. So hold on a minute. So 
So I've got different tunings. The guitars are in different tunings, and uh, um, I was talking too much there and picked up the wrong one. So this this wee song is um, uh, it's my version of the kind of night visiting song, and. Uh, I thought we might do this. The, the chorus is very easy. You sing, Will you hear me if I'm calling on this wild and windy night? Will you catch me if I'm falling on this wild and windy night? So it's, when, Will you hear me if I'm calling on this wild and windy night? Will you catch me if I'm falling on this wild and windy night? And uh, this, is a, this would be a perfect one if you've got your, if you're watching on your computer and your telly and you've got your phone and you, and you want to sort of send me, you know, post the video of you singing the chorus, this would be a perfect one to do. So we'll do the chorus a couple of times before we start the song just so that you can get the hang of it. Okay. Goes like this. Will you hear me? Will you hear me if I on this wild and windy night Will you catch me if I'm falling On this wild and windy night That's what you sing, okay, try that Will you hear me if I'm falling On this wild and windy night Will you catch me On this wild and windy night. One more time and we'll have it nailed. Here we go. Will you hear me if I'm calling? On this wild and windy night. Will you catch me if I'm falling? On this wild and When I may lose my way back home Lose the signs that I've been shown Wander helpless through the storm All alone Will you hear me if I'm calling On this wild When I mean lose the sense to run, finish what I've not begun, fading with the winter sun, everything undone. Will you hear me if I'm calling on this wild? Fantastic. <laughs> That's so fantastic, I think you should do it again. Here we go again. Will you hear 
practical now, but Mr. Tatty Face says he wants to do one on his own, so we'll let him do one on his own. Okay? Thank you very much, and uh, that was um, Wild and Windy Night. Um, uh, it's not a wild and windy night, actually. It's been a beautiful day here in Perthshire, in Scotland. Uh, the first of, a, I think, a first sort of spring, beautiful, warm spring, summer's day, and uh, the nature has just sort of come alive, and uh, the geese have been flying over the village, uh, heading north, and even today there was t two or three pairs of... Uh, Curlews flew over the village, heading up to the moors, which is a beautiful thing to hear. And um, so I'm going to do this. Uh, yeah, and um, I'm going to finish this. This is the end of that, that my wee half hour. So I'm going to finish with this. And uh, this is a wee song by our national poet um, called Robert Burns. And uh, um, I, I've done a lot of his songs over the years. He's a fantastic... He was a sort of... Uh, uh, Mid-1750s and um, was um, a great sort of inspiration to people like me and who, who like to kind of sing these songs and put kind of thoughts and ideas down in with melodies. And uh, Burns was a, 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 a star at that uh, whole business. So um, I'll leave you with this uh, wee song and... Uh, Thank you very much for tuning in. I hope you, uh, you enjoyed your wee visit again to the old schoolhouse. Uh, at this stage, I always like to kind of thank, this is one of the reasons I'm doing this is is because I want to be able to thank all the NHS worker people and the carers and all the people who are out there at the sharp edge, um, uh, you know, making sure that our lives are, kind of, the wheels of our lives are still mo moving. And, uh, and all the people who are emptying the bins and the people that are doing the deliveries and the, the, the people working behind the checkouts at the supermarkets and everything, you know, just thank you so much um, for, for being there. And in fact, I'm going to just have a wee toast of my 12-year-old malt whiskey to you all and I'll just say Slang Java. And... Uh, Oh. Huh? Oh, yeah. And um, so I, I thought, too, that it might be quite good for... Yeah, so here we go. So we've been watching... <laughs> so many people have been writing in and from all over the world. It's quite incredible, you know, from all over Scotland, on the UK, all over America and Europe. And I've been reading out some of the, the more uh, exotic ones, which is really exciting to come from this little school where my father learned to write on a slate with a piece of chalk. And um, here's me per, uh, broadcasting to the entire planet from, from, from the same building. And uh, so this is the wee list of, um, of, of exotic places that we got yesterday, which was people are watching, for, or for tonight, people are watching from the Czech Republic, from Venezuela, from Japan, I never got to Japan. I would love to have got to Japan. Um, 
Moscow, um, Afghanistan, India, Ho Chi Minh City in Vietnam, Croatia, Mallorca, the Lebanese Republic, Greenland, Finland, Denmark and Sweden, and Col Colrain in Northern Ireland. Hi, the folks in Colrain. And um, so um, uh, it's fantastic. So, so I hope you're all looking after each other and, uh, and uh, staying calm and and Thank you very much, and uh, that was Burns' beautiful song, uh, Call the Yows, and um, I'll leave you with that. Thank you very much uh, for joining, uh, for uh, tuning in. 
you all look after each other and uh, and I'll see you in a couple of days. We have these every two nights, so I'll see you. You've now got the boxed set. The, 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 you can binge Doogie McLean now. You've got ten. Series one is now complete and you can binge the te all ten together, <laughs> the boxed set of live from Butterstone. But anyway, uh, until, uh, what, what, what night will that be? Uh, Wednesday, Wednesday, eh? Friday night. So I'll see you on uh, Friday. I've lost track of the days. Isn't that typical? Of, uh, I mean. So I'll see you on Friday night at 8 o'clock. And uh, Aikava, you take care of yourselves. Night, night, Aikava. <laughs>